Our tiny 8,000 mile wide planet Earth is closest to our star, our million mile wide sun this week. So if we're closer to the sun in January, why is it so cold in January? Simple. In January, our northern hemisphere is tilted away from the sun and receives much less direct solar energy, while in July, it's tilted toward the sun. Okay. We got our sky set up for January 6th, about an hour before sunrise facing southeast, where you'll see a crescent moon just above the ring planet Saturn. Then on January 10th, a super skinny 28-day-old moon will snuggle up just to the left of brilliant Venus in one of the best planet-moon pairings of the year. And on the evening of January 13th, the moon will be above Mars. Then on January 21st, a gibbous moon will be just above Jupiter. So even though we're as close to the sun as we ever get this week, we recommend you bundle up as you keep, keep looking, looking up. up.